What is up guys, White Citadel here, and I have the Egg McMuffin of gameplays right now. This is one of those fantastic games where you are on the shittiest team imaginable. You are playing the shittiest team imaginable, and you just put up an amazing score and everyone else absolutely sucks. And you barely, 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 barely win. The other team was slightly better than my team, so even though everyone was terrible, uh, they were the better team aside from me as a player. And this gameplay, this is just ridiculous. Watch this comeback in the middle of this game. Watch the score towards the end. It is absolutely fantastic. Me putting the team on my back like usual in Team Deathmatch. And it's one of those games, man, if I didn't have a ridiculous game, if I just had a really, really, really good game and it wasn't like a god tier game, we would have lost. We would have gotten raped. So I love gameplays like this. It just lights up my day. It makes my entire week better. Even though my Predator missiles are absolutely garbage in this video, I apologize in advance. So right now I'm just running around the map. As I always do, I always stay to the very far edge of the map. Anyone that wants to be a good player, always stay to the very far edge of the map. Never run around the middle. Nothing good is going to come of that. You might get one kill, you might get two, but you're going to get shot in the back or from the side at some point. Always stay to the edges. And when you have a submachine gun like I do, as you see, I'm staying close to cover at all times. I'm trying to avoid long lines of sight. Being a big, big sound tour this game, I love these houses on this level. You can just hear people walking around, you hear the footsteps. You'll see me a bunch of times this gameplay, I will just totally stop, I'll like freeze and just pause in one spot for a minute. That's because I hear people running about. Something you won't hear uh, on YouTube, but it's what I'm doing. I hear people on my headset. I know it's going, I know something's going down. So just running around. Uh, as you see, I've, I've already had a ridiculous game. I think I'm like 7 or 8 and 0 right now, and we're still losing 23 to 33. So the, the deficit of this game gets even worse, and then we make a ridiculous comeback at the very end of the game uh, as a result of me raping. So let's see what we got here. Moving around, moving around, moving around. Drop shotting. Man, if you guys don't drop shot, you need to learn. I've estimated that for every four or five kills I get from drop shotting, I might miss one knife. So yeah, you're going to miss some knives because knife button's going to be B button. But it's going to be totally worth it because... Man, you're going to get so many more drop shots. You're going to survive so many more gun battles when you drop to the ground. People just don't understand the concept of following you with their aimer. They keep shooting where you were standing. People are too bad to understand to shoot at the ground where you lay down. Man, drop shotting is just ridiculous. It works so well for me. So here we go. First pave low. Still haven't died yet this gameplay. What is the score? We're still down six kills. Okay, manageable. Not too bad, not too bad, not too bad. We should win this. My pave low is going to get me a lot of kills. Uh, let's see, we got a red dot up ahead. Let's take a look. Oh, Pavlo's down. These kill streaks, this game, were worthless. My Predator missiles were bad. That was my fault. But the two helicopters got shot down right away. I really wish in this game it was a little bit harder to shoot down kill streaks. I work really hard sometimes to get that seven kill streak and get the attack helicopter in the sky. And man, it gets shot down half the time before it even makes it over the map. That's why I like Predator missiles and airstrikes a little bit more because they are locked kills. They're guaranteed. The attack helicopter might get me 7 or 8 kills, or it might get me 0. So if you want that lock kill, man, get, just get the airstrike up, get a Predator missile. Those things are going to get you kills for sure, as long as you have a UAV up. So, right now I'm sound touring, big time. I hear the guy. He's in this building, or he's around. I'm just going to wait in this corner. Let him come around the corner, and let me ice him when he walks around the corner. And I hear him coming up the steps right behind me, so later, man. And look at this, another free kill right here. Another Predator missile. Will it be as bad as the first one? Let's find out here. And yes, of course it is. I did not see the shadow of the nose of the plane. This is a brand new map for me. I've only played it three or four times. I didn't realize there was a nose of a plane there, and I just put the Predator missile right on top of it. I think you guys all know that feeling where you see someone, you see the red box, you're like, cool, here goes a kill, and then they're actually in a thinly disguised uh, piece of cover. And what just happened, it's one of my biggest pet peeves with this game. If you were shooting someone with a gun, they are not going to be able to knife you effectively. I was getting hit markers on that guy, and he still managed to knife me and kill me. Uh, that's one of my biggest pet peeves in Call of Duty. And if you're if you're eating bullets, if you're getting lit up, you're not going to have an effective knife. You're not going to have a fatal knife blow. And it's funny in this game that you can survive a 50 caliber bullet to the chest, but if someone knifes you with like a, this worthless like slashing action, you're dead instantly. Absolutely ridiculous. So. Running around the outside of the map, uh, this game's getting a little bit out of, hand, out of hand right now. As you see, they're about to hit 80,000, and we haven't hit 70,000 yet. So, it's looking bad, looking pretty bad at this point, but fortunately, 
I go on a little tear here in a minute, running around, looking for people to kill. Uh, enemy team's got air support in. I hate that when the air support comes in right behind you and you're the only one. You know that air support's going to come shooting for you. I barely, barely, barely escape right here. Just by the freaking fraction of an inch right there. That helicopter was lighting me up. Good thing the helicopter has the most worthless cannons. I mean, you can take like eight hit markers from those helicopters and still be alive. So, worked in my favor right there. I would have gotten killed. And man, when you see the final score, you'll realize that every time I avoid death in this gameplay was quite important because... <laughs> It is a very close game. This comeback is hot in a few minutes. Here's a fishy play right here. I just, I don't know, I, I shoot that other guy several times and then he hits me a couple times and I die. Whatever, I've died twice. I'm probably at 20 plus kills right now. I, I'm not too upset about it. What I am upset about though is that at this point I am certain this game is over. We have 78, they have 91. All they need is 9 kills before we can get 22 kills. But fortunately, they are terrible. Look at that filthy drop shot on the kid that had the jump on me. And how bad was that kid? I really wish sometimes they had a death cam when you kill people in the upper right hand corner of the screen. You could see a little uh, a little photo of what they saw because I don't understand how that kid could not kill me. How he was that terrible. I was looking the other way, turn around and hip fire drop shot him. This guy, he gets punked. He didn't have a chance. He jumped over the wall and there's that fraction of a second recovery time. This guy, I don't know what the hell this guy's doing. Looking off into cyberspace when I run around the corner on him. This guy just gets outplayed. Predator missile, is it going to be effective? I haven't gotten one kill yet with it. Double kill. There we go, baby. Now we are talking. Attack helicopter. I am on a tear. This game is right down to the wire right now. Five kills left for each team. Make it four for us. Make it three for them. This is a close game, as close as it gets. Right now, don't die. Don't die. Hang in there on me. 98-98. I get a kill. Boom, baby. Teammate picks up the other kill. Look at this final score, 10,000 to 9,800. That is as close as you're going to get in a game to 100 kills, 100 to 98 final score. Putting up ham numbers, putting the team on my back, 32 and 2. I am out, guys. Later.